Earth's closest twin has been identified and is located. The planet in question is an exoplanet, which is almost the same size as Earth and is orbiting a very small star just 72 light years away. The planet goes by the name K2415b and resembles Earth in many ways. The similarities that K2415b and Earth share may uncover the mysteries of how planets like ours evolve and form when in different environments and solar systems. This may also lead us closer to understanding what conditions make a habitable planet when in different environments to Earth. It is possible to study the atmosphere variability of rocky planets and the conditions under which a livable habitable world can exist on small planets orbiting and dwarfs. Since K2415 is one of the lowest mass stars known to have a transiting planet of Earth's size, it will be an intriguing target for more follow-up observations, such as radial velocity monitoring and transit spectroscopy. The Milky Way contains a vast number of planets and mysteries. The question of our existence and its origins is one of the most pervasive of all time. We also wonder if there are any additional Earth-like planets somewhere in the universe. Having a population of Earth-like exoplanets to study is a useful tool for answering this question, given Earth is the only site in the universe where we know for sure that life has emerged. Size, chemical makeup, temperature, mass, and possibly even planetary system architecture are all similar. Small, Earth-sized exoplanets orbiting nearby, small stars in such a way that they transit, or pass between us and the star, make an excellent starting point for this kind of research. They are the most fitting representatives of a certain environment. Light from the star will be filtered through the exoplanet's atmosphere as it transits in front of the star, with some spectral lines being absorbed or increased by atmospheric components. The habitable temperature zone is located far closer to smaller, fainter, cooler stars like red dwarfs than it is to the sun. Since the orbital period is shorter, a greater number of transits can be recorded and superimposed to increase the signal in the spectrum. Furthermore, the brightness of nearby stars will increase, making it easier to perform such observations. In contrast to huge exoplanets, little ones are more difficult to discover. Only 14 Earth-sized or smaller exoplanets orbiting red dwarf stars have been discovered within 100 light years of the solar system and all seven of these planets are part of the TRAPPIST-1 system. In this case, more is better, and it appears that Hirano and his colleagues have uncovered a first of its sort. K2415b is a 1.015 Earth radius exoplanet that orbits a red dwarf star, making it one of the most compact stellar hosts of a planet of Earth's size discovered so far. The mass of K2415 is only 16% of that of the Sun. The exoplanet was first detected in 2017 using data from the now-defunct Kepler Plan and Hunting Telescope, and it has since been confirmed using data from Kepler's replacement, TESS. As a follow-up, the team conducted infrared measurements to look for any wiggle in the star's velocity caused by the planet's gravity. This plethora of information proved the existence of a world and provided insight into its makeup. The radius of the exoplanet can be determined by measuring the amount of starlight it blocks during transit. Its mass is proportional to the extent by which it wobbles. The density of the exoplanet can be estimated using these two values, and the regularity of the transits is a good indicator of the exoplanet's orbital period. It's around this point when K2415b begins to diverge significantly from Earth. The exoplanet is roughly the size of Earth, but its mass is roughly three times that of our planet. Because of this, K2415b must also be denser than Earth. As a result of its proximity to its star, its orbit takes only four days. Indeed, a red dwarf star's habitable zone can be much closer than the Sun's, with orbits measured in days rather than months, but, even for a red dwarf, such proximity would be too close for comfort but just a touch. The planet K2415b is located on the very edge of K2 habitable 415 zone. It's possible that this means there is still an atmosphere to explore. Among the planets in our solar system, 
Venus is the closest to having an atmosphere that could support life. If K2415 is a system with multiple planets, then there's a chance that one of them is a habitable exoplanet that has yet to be discovered. There probably isn't any life on K2415b. However, the system is a great place to seek hidden, potentially life-supporting worlds and characterize their atmospheres through follow-up studies.